Guys, how's it going? Token vaping. So um, today's juice review is going to be another flavor in a line that I just recently started. Um, the company, the line itself is called Confection, and this flavor that was sent to me for the purpose of this review is called Fetty Pop, and it is supposed to be a strawberry birthday cake pop. So if you've ever had like the the round uh, chunks of cake that's on a stick, so basically it's a cake lollipop. This is going to be supposed to be reminiscent of that. So it's going to be a birthday cake with strawberry. Um, I'm not sure yet if it's supposed to be like a strawberry frosting or if it's just supposed to be an all around strawberry tasting cake uh, with the sweetness that you would get on that on the stick or, or pop. So we're going to jump right into that. This is the bottle. Very simple, but the subtleness of the colors and the label and the logo itself kind of do pop enough just so that you can. Um, it does catch your eye, but it's not anything that's super, you know, over the top or out there to where you feel like it's more of the more of the time spent on it is going to be in the labeling and not what's inside the bottle. So we'll definitely jump on that. As always, there is fresh cotton right there. And as you guys know, and yes, I do always have to say this because it's only fair and nice to do, but tough wicks. It's just my choice, always has been um, since I started using them. I basically use it in all my, all my reviews. Uh, easy to easy to use, uh, really quick uh, break in time. Um, sometimes, most of the time, I don't even really have to wait a whole lot for the flavor to kick in. But it is really nice to have that. That link, as always, will be in that suggest the comment box down below, right next to like and subscribe. If you do like this video, it's greatly appreciated. So we're gonna jump right into this, and like I said. The marketing on this, as far as the labeling and the advertising, the way this looks is actually pretty nice. And I also like, and a quick shout out to a friend of mine that I met at this past day's expo, she did bring up a good point. I do kind of like when they put the flavor profile either on the bottle or on the box if there is one so that you know what it's supposed to be. A lot of times you get a flavor and you may enjoy the, the taste of it um, or you're looking at it, but it has some really weird name to it and it just kind of throws you off because you're not really sure what it's supposed to taste like, but when companies go ahead and put the the flavor profile there as well, it makes it a lot easier just in general, and it's just kind of nice to know. So we're going to pop this open, and as you can see, there is a security tab here, which it did pop, and there is your nozzle, which makes it really easy to work with as well. So, Okay, so it definitely has a frosting type smell to that. So I'm hoping that it's not going to be overly sweet in the vape as well, because if I understand that it's supposed to be a birthday cake style uh, flavor, but you don't ever really want it to be entirely all frosting, just because then there's no point in calling it a cake. You can just call it frosting. So we will see here in a second if that's going to be the case, or if it's just because the frosting does have, it's supposed to have a stronger sweetness smell to it, that that's what you smell on the inhale, as far as uh, when you when you open up the bottle, and we'll see if the frosting, does, uh, the cake part of it does come out within the vape itself. So I'm just going to go ahead and get this all juiced. Okay, that's a good sign too. On the... Um, on a burn off like that basically I do actually get more of a pastry or cake style smell to that it's not all the super sweet frosting so I'm gonna go ahead and pop that on give me one second here and this is Fetty Pop from Confections So I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick retrip, and as always, I do this one because it is new cotton, so even though it has little to no break in time, it still does need a, a slight bit to help get it going. But also, it's mainly just because I wanna make sure that if there is something in the flavor profile that kind of works its way into the vape the more you use it, or if something on it is it seems really, really strong on the first try, and because it hasn't broken in yet, and it does mellow out, I wanna be able to get that so that I don't tell you one thing and then find out later on that, oh, you know what? It actually isn't that 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 strong. It does mellow out, but I wouldn't know that, you know, and then I end up saying something that I shouldn't and then everybody goes into the misinformation thing. So just bear with me here on this one.
and that is why I definitely do these. So I'm actually kind of surprised. The inhale off the bottle when you open it, you definitely get a lot more of the frosting smell, um, the sweetness of that. The vape itself, however, it is not as strong in that as I thought it was going to be. The When you vape it, you most definitely get the cake taste, which is a good thing because that's also part of the, the main flavor. Um, but the sweetness as far as the frosting of this is actually more of an undertone exhale than it is, you know, um, like a, a center stage flavor or on the inhale. It's actually really surprising because, again, like I said, you think birthday cake and it's supposed to be, you know, you auto people automatically assume there's frosting involved and they're expecting that sweetness to hit and that's not the case here. Yeah, you get a nice overtone of strawberry throughout it. So you can definitely, you do, you do de taste the strawberry without it being super, super harsh or too strong, um, just to give it a little bit of a flavor kick to it. The cake part, it's more of like the, like the, just a regular sponge cake style where it's fluffier without being overly sweet in itself. And the frosting, like I said, it's more of an undertone aftertaste on it. It is not super sweet it is not over the top it's not going to coat your tongue to where you, f you literally feel like you ate like two slices of cake within 10 minutes so this was definitely this definitely is a surprising flavor it's just enough to give it a little bit of that sweet tooth kick without being overly much to where you basically feel like you're done with it and you're not going to vape it again for a while so definitely check this out like i said the company name is the line is confection this is this is fetty pop I will uh, the Instagram check out their Instagram page. They do have a link to their uh, to where you can purchase them on here. I will put that link in the comment box as well. Also, um, they are available in 60 ml bottles, and it is a zero, three, and a six nicotine level as well. And as always, guys, thank you so much for taking the moment to stop by, check out this video. If there is anything out there that you want to see reviewed or have questions about, please definitely message me. Let me know. I will do everything I can to get that going for you guys. Um, and anything else that I can do to help any of you out there find that next all day vape for you is why I do what I do. So until next time, as always, always truly love yourself. Have a good day guys.